Hey there, in this video, I will show you how you can create navigation or you can say routes in React application. So I have set up one simple React application with three pages, home, about and users. Okay. And the HTML and CSS I have copied from this Bulma CSS framework. Okay. So right now you can see when I click on about, it will reload and redirect to about page, but the content is not reloading, not changing. Okay. And we also don't want to reload the page. We need a feel like one page application when you use react. Okay. So to do that, we will use one react NPM package. You can say an NPM package. The name of that package is react outer door. Okay. So this is uh, one of the very popular package that is used for creating routers for react. Okay. So you can see when I uh, try to Google it, I found this link and the version of this NPM package is five. Okay. But the latest version you can see, let me open the website. It is 6.4, I guess. Okay. So the latest version is 6.4. Okay. So when you try to install this NPM package, it will install this latest version, but somehow there are few uh, documentation changes which require, I think they are not updated yet, but as you can see on version five, there are a uh, few documentation that you can use and it is very straightforward. So I like this. Okay. So in this video, I will try to set up using this documentation, but we will use this latest version 6.4.3. So I try to find uh, the documentation, how I can set up using this latest version, but I couldn't do that. So uh, I have created this video. So you might uh, find this useful. Okay. So first of all, let's install npm install react router dome okay so let's go to packet.json and it it should it, um, install this latest version 6.4.3 i guess so it should be yeah so you can see react router dome 6.4.3 okay so this is done let let me um, start the server npm start okay so now let me uh, just delete okay so now let's start setup so go to our documentation first of all we need to import these dependencies so in app.js let's import this okay this is fine okay. and first of all first of all what we need to do we need to wrap this navigation within route router okay so let me add this okay no error fine so first of all we need to go to navigation.js and whenever you are using anchor tag we need to make sure we are replacing it with link okay so we should replace anchor tag with link so this is one anchor tag and link, link, link. And instead of using href, you need to make sure you change it to two. Okay. So using this npm package, it will not redirect. It will simply re-render. And yeah, here two is already there. Okay. And here we have link. So you need to make sure we are using link. Now we have an error. Link is not defined. Yes, this is fine. We need to import this link from React Router to. Okay, let's go to this and import this link. And we can remove here. We don't need link here. Okay, so now error is not there. Okay, so let's go to console and yeah, class is not defined. So what we have to do, uh, we might have class somewhere. 
okay let's see where we have class class is equal to maybe some other pages maybe users about us here we have class we can change it to class name because class is reserved keyword okay in navigation okay now we can ignore these errors all right now the setup is done in our navigation.js okay so now you can see the page is not reloaded but the rendering is not working right so to make sure that rendering works we need to use this switch okay so let's go to app.js and in that route router we need to use this switch so control x switch and in switch we have to define specific route so for home page we need something like this okay let's copy and paste again and so now we are good okay so as per this documentation uh, you can change it to path about and here users so we need exact matching so you can use one other attribute called exit so if you see now using this documentation referring to this documentation if you use this switch it will throw an error like switch is not supported so this latest version 6.4.3 this switch will not work okay so what we have to do we have to replace our switch with routes you can say routes and replace it here okay so now we have router routes and route okay so now let's see let's go to console and taking some time to reload okay. now we still have some error okay so what this error is saying home is not the route okay so still syntax is not 100 percent correct so we have router okay in that routers we have routes you can say routes and a specific route so in this specific version we have to use element and in element you need to pass its rendering okay so something like this element and in element you need to pass this about okay. similarly we need to pass element and again x okay. so now it should be fine Now you can see you are on about page this is about content you are on users this is user page and when you go to home it will reload it will not reload but it will render the home page content so you can see the page is not reloading right it is like tabs you can easily switch so lab m is equal to hm.com this is blog and submit okay so uh, i have created this user component and uh, using the states and props you can uh, visit my channel and the previous video is there that you can find how this is working okay but in this specific video i'm making sure you are uh, really uh, clear about these routers how this navigation works okay so if you refer to the documentation 
this version 5 you can see switch is there but in latest version let me open the packet.json so in this latest version 6.4.3 no switch is there and instead of switch you need to use routes and instead of rendering in this route you need to pass that component name into element okay so this is a very crucial change when you try to upgrade from version 5 to version 6.4.3 okay and you might uh, be uh, aware that when you upgrade the npm package you need to make sure that uh, the required changes to be done because otherwise it will not work as expected okay so you can also refer this documentation i think uh, this is in progress so uh, i'm not sure if it is completed but yeah you can refer this document and uh, you are good to go okay all right guys so you can see now uh, this routing works fine and uh, page is not redirecting or reloading it is simply uh, re-rendering your component okay so guys this is all for this video i hope you like this video if you have any concern or any questions or any suggestion you can leave your comments below and you can visit my channel there are more than 190 videos uh, uploaded on my channel um, including css uh, javascript wordpress and node.js and that's all for this video guys see you around thank you